Augustus Landor? I am. And you're at the Academy? I'm here to inform you. you. Captain Hitchcock at your service, second in command. Superintendent Sayer requests an immediate audience. When might this take place? Not your earliest. And the nature of this audience? I'll leave that to the Colonel. It's convenience. <laughs> <laughs> I should decide not to come. And if... Well, that would be your own concern. You're a private citizen. <sighs> oh, it's a fine day for a ride. The Gobbity Constables. I want to suggest that you're a legend. Among New York's when he recommended your services, he noted your impressive accomplishment. The Daybreak Boys breaking up the dreaded shirt tails gashments, including apprehending the leaders of and solving a particularly grisly murder. Your talent murder of a young prostitute in Elysian fields to include co-breaking, riot control, and Mr. Sun from Gloucester, who came to New York while still in your gloveless interrogation. There are many teams. And three years now. You are a widower, Mr. Landor. Shall I send for coffee? Be here. Nicely. Do you, uh, it's in a pigeonhole back there somewhere? You keep these nowhere, do you? What else do they say? Do they say that? In a long time, I haven't darkened the door of the church. I should mention that my daughter. Where of your daughter's disappearance? Ran off a while back. We are. We offer our sympathies. I'm not a fan. No, 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 no. no. Well, with all due respect, I hope I. No, sorry. Not to apologize. Carry on, Mr. Landor. We apologize. And I do. Please. We are obliged to proceed with extreme disc of well documented industry intact. Who Russian. We're looking for someone, a private citizen, who might carry out inquiries on the Academy's behalf. A highly complex and delicate nature and concern of. Huh. They are one of our cadets. Second year, Leroy Fry. There's no point in dancing around. A man from Kentucky by the name of Fry. Hold it. Fry hanged himself. No. Oh. Um, so. Last night. Sorry to hear that. A dreadful business decision. We have been specifically charged with this. But you must understand our position. Part of the care of these young men to make them gentlemen. We like to think we're no friend to and soldiers. And to that end, we drive them. Well, to stop driving them. Ah, that's a matter for the coroner. I'm afraid that a boy hangs himself. That's not the end of it. Cadet Frank in the hospital ward. Fry's body was violated last night. Violated? I need to summon you. I'm sure the academy has. By whom? Well, if we knew that, we would have had no need. As a sheriff prankster. This was no prank. Roy Fry's heart was carved from his chest. Mr. Landor. The rest. How does a person go about doing this? Dr. Marquis. Scalpel. Or hey, but getting to the heart. That's the good sharp knife would do. The tricky part. Those liver came from angling the blade to gashes on the lungs and save the heart and container of some sort how would one preserve the heart wrapped in muslin maybe or pounded by ice what type newspaper very likely some type of fellow could do this strong one as i've ever had the pleasure of meeting no not a woman but no woman what about his medical Pedigree. What do you need to do yourself? Not be as well educated and 
well trained. Necessarily? You'd need a lot of light. You wouldn't have to be a doctor or a surgeon. Right. And know where to cut, but you'd have to be a bad man. Mark! Mark! I'm still out there. Have to forgive me, Mr. Landor. You find us certain powerful senators in Washington would like nothing but a very delicate position. For us more than to see us fail utterly, to shut us down. To help save the honor of the United States. I am asking you, States Military Academy. You were... Then save it, I'll try. For, uh, on guard duty last night. 9.30. Relieved at midnight and made my way back to the guard room. Hey, Mr. Huntu. Yes, sir. Posted. Where is that? Number four, sir. By four. Here with the grounds, but it seems that the part we're standing on, right? Quentin. Uh, I admit I'm not very familiar. Now it is not on the way from far. Oh, I took you off course then. Well, sir, on my way. Fort Clinton to North Barracks. No, sir. I heard something. I reckoned it was an animal. I came to help. I'm terribly partial to animals. It sounded like it was dying or caught in a trap, so I, I... I was running this way. How do you look? Not well, sir. Very until I brushed Cadet Fry, sir. He wasn't hanging straight. It was almost as if... Not following you. But he was seated in the chair. Oh. His feet were touching the ground. His feet were touching the ground? No, sir. Ran, ran straight. Back. Right. What did you do next? Back to North Barracks. Hmm. Ah, one last question, and 